Hi kids, welcome to Rina's YouTube channel. Today we are going to see about decimals. Okay, come let's go. What is decimals? The decimal numeral system is the standard system for denoting integer and non-integer values. These decimal number contains a decimal point. For example, 1.57. We know 1 is a whole number and the place value of 1 is 1's position. Then dot is a decimal point. The place value of 5 is 10th and the place value of 7 is 100th position. We can expand this decimal value by two ways. First, the decimal value of 1.57 is equal to 1 plus 0.5 plus 0 0.07. We can expand this in fraction form that is 157 by 100 is equal to 1 plus 5 by 10 plus 7 by 100. Okay. Next, equivalent decimals. Adding or removing zeros at the end of the decimal number does not change its value. These numbers are called equivalent decimals. For example, 0 0.2 equal to 0 0.20 equal to 0 0.200. This can also be checked by comparing the decimals with the equivalent fractions. That is 2 by 10 equal to 20 divided by 100 equal to 200 divided by 1000. Like and unlike decimals. Decimals with the same number of decimal places are called the like decimals. For example 0 0.3, 4.5, 8.7. Here the decimal place values are same. So they are called like decimals. Next unlike decimals. Decimals having different number of decimal places are called unlike decimals. For example 0 0.7 and 2.81. Here the decimal place values are different. Okay. Next we will see about how to convert unlike decimals into like decimals. To convert unlike decimals into like decimals, find their equivalent decimals up to the same number of places. For example, consider the unlike decimals 1.7, 8.36, 9.755. Now we have to convert these unlike decimals into like decimals. We got 1.700, 8.360, 9.755. To convert decimals, first convert them into like decimals. For example, to convert the numbers 50.08 and 50.3. First convert these decimal numbers into like decimals. Then we got the numbers 50.08 and 50.30. Now convert these two numbers, we got 50.30 is the greatest number. Now we can see how to add the two decimal numbers. Adding the decimal number is just like adding whole numbers but remember to place the decimal points one below the other. For example, two decimal numbers are 0 0.3 and 0 0.28. First convert these two decimal numbers into equivalent decimals. Then add these two numbers just like a whole number addition. For example, 0 0.30 plus 0 0.28 we got the answer 0 0.58. Subtracting decimal number is just like subtracting whole numbers. For example, 0 0.64 and 0 0.4. First convert these decimals into equivalent decimals and subtract these two decimals just like whole number subtraction. Then we got the answer. In multiplication, multiply as in whole numbers ignoring the decimal. Then count the total number of decimal places in both numbers and starting from the right count the same number of decimal places in the product and place the decimal point there. For example 0 0.05 into 6. Multiply these two numbers as whole number we got 30. Here the total number of decimal places 2. So put the decimal point moves two places from the right side. So the answer is 0 0.30. Dividing by decimal is just like dividing whole numbers except for placing the decimal point in the divider. That is place the decimal point in the quotient directly above the decimal points. Then divide as if you were dividing whole numbers. For example divide 4.35 and 3. We got the quotient 1.45. 